everyone. Welcome to Garden Yarns. My name is Christine. This is where we talk about knitting, crochet, and anything yarn related. Today is episode 61 and this is actually Monday, October 4th. How is everybody doing again? Uh, today is I'm going to catch up on all my crochet society stuff. I have two unboxings and to talk about what we got for the cro uh, crochet society cow. So I'll get started with that, okay? Uh, this is box 25, I think. Cute little floral design. And she always has things wrapped so nicely inside. It says a little less to do, a little more to da. Of course, I've already opened it previously to see what all was in here. Uh, we got two balls of Bella Coco Kaleidoscope yarn. Very pretty pastel -y colors. This is color Rainbow Drops. Very pretty, and we got two of those. And it's a DK and it's 100 grams. So very pretty, white with pastels. You got two of those. And you got a little handy tool about checking your gauge and a conversion chart, very sparkly. And we got a lovely floral crochet hook. This is a 3.75. Usually I don't go less than a 4 millimeter, but this is pretty close. And we got a cute floral stitch marker. And we got this cute handy hook storage container. So very nice. And we also got some stickers, hook sizes, scissors, floral, ball of yarn. Very nice. And this is the pattern book. Oh, that's very pretty. I might actually do that one, one day. And there's Sarah Jane Bella Coco. And this is shows you what's in it. So yes, this is very pretty, the shawl. It's called the Kaleidoscope Shawl. And then it shows you what's in your box. And the different colors of the Kaleidoscope yarns that are available. That's cute too. You can do like a little baby blanket with a lay hearts design. I'm going to tell you how to do filet crochet and then there's some graph paper. Very nice. So yeah, that'll be a toss up between which one of those two patterns I do in there. I'm very happy with this box. Love the yarn. Oh, don't want to forget the gauge. Very pretty. This one's really cute. It's got little cats on it. I believe this is box 27. I could be wrong about the box numbers. And yes, I already had a peek in this one too. Oh. This is what's inside. So yes, I'm a Kurumi. And this time we have Bella Coco Crook 
actually charmed chunky. I think they say it's like a roving style yarn. So we have it. This is 85% acrylic, 5% mohair, 10% wool made in Turkey. And we have a color. Color is Mystic. And this pretty light pink one is called Alchemy. A L C H E M Y. Very pretty. And we got a cute little water bottle with a little kit kitty on it. It says, I love playing with yarn. And we got a cute enamel kitten pen pin. Very cute. And we got a kitty ice cream cone. Oh, this looks like you can judge the thickness of your yarn. And this would be the amigurumi eyes and whatnot there. Oh, there's another cowl on here. That looks pretty. Yep, there is a little kitten up. Or groomy little cup or something there. I guess that cowl looks pretty nice. Might do that. And this shows you what's in the box. Oh, the hook. That's what I'm missing. I did try the hook and I did enjoy using it. This is more my size, a 550, nice sparkly green. I'll put that in the box so I don't forget where it is. And here's the different colors of the yarn. Oh, it's a cat donut. Very cute. And then it shows you what other people have made with the boxes. I'm way behind on my box making, but you know I get easily sidetracked by other things. So yeah, very cute. This is really soft yarn. Can never get it back in the way they pack it so nice and neat. kitty box. They found out she was doing a cow, so I had to get on that. It's a pillow. Uh, you got the cute tote bag. And on the other side it says, shh, I'm counting. Very cute. And it's jam-packed with yarn. This is Bella Coco Crochet Hibiscus Chunky. Very soft, pretty blue. Uh, this one is, this is the same. This is 100% acrylic. Color, this is Color Tours 14. And this is Tahiti 9. So far. Yep, there's still more in here. This ball got a little messy, but that's all right. This is Elena 30. Kind of like a taupe color. And this is BG 19. It's like a gray. Nice pretty peach color, Hawaii 4. There's a little book in here that didn't travel too well, but it says, shh, I'm counting. 
and it's just different types of paper that you can plot your ideas on. Here's some graph uh, paper and some plain paper as well, so very handy to have. And then there's several balls of this color. This is Ohu. Uh, it's O A H U, so I've kind of butchered that a little bit. 11. It's another gray. And you get four balls of that color. So that's it for all the Crochet Society related things that I got recently. So I'll add this to my wish list of things to do. The cow did start yesterday, so I'm a little behind on starting that. Yeah, very cute. Nice and handy. So I may, I may uh, tackle this tomorrow. Get started and get caught up with that. So yes, uh, this is all I have for this video. Again, thank you everyone who leaves a positive comment, supports each other. And yes, thank you for liking and sharing my videos. I appreciate that as well. And just a friendly reminder, we do have a Facebook group to support this channel as well called Gardener. so we'll see you over there as well again i'll still make my weekly friday videos so i can't looking forward to seeing you all then take care have a great night bye